Hey, my name is Marco. I'm a former pro opera singer turned voice actor. Today we're going to be talking about Destiny some more. This is from The Taking King. It's called The Awoken. This is a Patreon request from Arctic the 12th Fatui Leakinger. And uh, yeah, let's just dive in. I love Destiny. I've been playing Destiny for about 500 hours over the course of however many years. It's a really important game, I think. And uh, the music is fantastic. So let's just dive right in. This sound specifically has this sort of, it sounds like a harpsichord mixed with a guitar, mixed with a piano. The Awoken are, if I remember, it's, it's a race from Destiny, right? And so this gives us a, a really unique and interesting sound. The Awoken are descendants of the human race that were aboard the Oxidus Green right before the collapse. And so you hear this sound that is certainly not necessarily human. It, it deviates from what we expect this instrument to sound like. Like I said, it does sound like three different instruments combined into one. I think it's all intentional due to the fact that this race is a descendant of humans. It has similar qualities, but it's also very different from what we know. And I think that's reflected in the music. I think it's interesting to have qualities here. It's very ethereal. It gives us a sense that we're not necessarily very grounded. The song is called The Awoken, so I think there is a tendency here to give this sound the quality of something that is not really tethered to what we know. That there is just the slight, slight dissonance in the sound quality because you have this very clear while also having this bo bay bong bom bee bong there's a little bit of clash there in terms of both rhythm and and just general structure, which I think really helps to continue to paint the picture of something known but unknown. I think it's so smart too to be adding these different percussive instruments. There's a marimba in there. It sounds like there's a xylophone coming in too. All of these things are used to highlight this, the Awoken essentially. It sounds like it's the anthem to this race in destiny. This is just continuing to highlight the differences, I think, in this race uh, that is descendant from from human. It's all there to to give them their own individual identity within the context of the game. You really hear their uniqueness within this melody. Oh, 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 oh. This sound is so interesting because it's both harmonious and disjointed. There is a clash in this that is very appealing and interesting. Oh. hear uh, resourcefulness in this. The tonal quality gives it the feeling that this is a group of people that have had to make do in their life. Maybe there's been racism towards them or, or maybe there's been prejudice placed on them. You hear their quality as a group of people and their ability to get things done. 
and their ability to rise up and face challenges. I love that too. When we shift from a closed vowel to an open vowel, it's a really, really powerful experience, both for the singer, but also for us as listeners. And she increases pitch there slightly. And again, I think that it's all there to give us a sense of like struggle and arrival and sacrifice, loss and success. You know, there's this back and forth and even something simple as, as just changing vowels has intention. this determination you hear this like simple beauty in this melody and i love that this melody is kind of pared down there's maybe only five to six instruments maybe even less and and it's all it's all very stripped away and very raw and very organic and i do think that maybe there's a connection there between the species past and how it came to be and this organic sound i also hear this warmth and the way that this singer is going up into their upper register and then also shifting back down in such an elegant way. I feel it's all very intentioned. I also love the emphasis here of ooh, ooh, ah, sort of the, this play with rhythm. Again, it gives us, whenever we have rhythm in, in any sort of context, a lot of the times it's there to play with tension and play with just, you know, if something is very placid and easygoing, you hear that in the music. And when, when there's this, sort of this playing with rhythm, ooh, ah, ooh, ah, there's you 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 can you can listen to that and really start to understand like character thought processes and what i like about this song is that it serves two purposes the one hand it's giving us essentially it's giving us a, a look at a species it's like if someone wrote the fanfare for the common man by copeland which copeland wrote it was technically based off of a speech that was made by uh, by henry wallace the vice president at the time in which uh, wallace proclaimed the dawning of the century of the common man so then copeland turned that and turned it into a piece of music that was a prime example in classical music of highlighting humanity and human ingenuity and capacity and, and much in the same way i think that this is an anthem in destiny to describe the awoken and uh, i think it's it's very smart when we use music to somehow highlight uh larger grander aspects of of people and uh this is obviously a beautiful way to do that there's a sense of of that beauty and that mis mystery in this music and the way that it's very pared down and we're using the vocal line and we're using vocalism as the primary instrument in a lot of ways and even though it does feel like it's it's a song that that the that the instruments are supporting the the vocal singing you always have this tendency and we've heard it in classical music before like the Rachmaninoff vocalese where we're allowing things to exist in the ether and and have it all come together uh by using all these different instruments as one and and it's not just a song where the vocals are over top of the uh, music this is all conjoined and i think it, it helps to give it this sort of 
mysterious ethereal sort of uh, it, you you get like a little bit of this outer spacey sort of sound and that's all coming from this choice of instrumentation and it's really really interesting as a listener and, and evocative it's really cool the song is awesome uh thanks so much for the suggestion i really appreciate it and as always thank you so much if you want to join the discord feel free there's lots more destiny to come and as always thank you so much and i'll talk to you later bye <laughs>